Everybody's got opinions on nothing. Say we're flying down a path with no ending. And if I die before. Hi, this is Olu from Earth Gang. My name's Tiana Major Nine, and I'm from East London. We are on the set of the Collide music video. Earth Gang featuring Tiana Major Nine for the feature film Queen and Slim. Beautiful. It was important to be a part of the Queen and Slim soundtrack because this is this is just another one of those films that uh, kind of defines the storytelling of a generation. Um, I think it's so important for black people to have these stories that um, kind of range from you know we got Spider Man on one end to. Queen and Slim on the other end, and it's important to be able to kind of paint our own pictures and to tell our stories from our perspective. You know, being on the run, being in our own neighborhoods and having people look out for us and, you know, just finding friends in unlikely places and stuff. So I think it's very important. It was important for me to be a part of the Queen and Slim soundtrack because it's a story about black love. Um, and that's something that we don't see on TV a lot in the UK. Collide is a, it's such a beautiful song. Um, it's hard to describe. It's kind of just very serene, very truthful, very literal, and kind of relaxing at the same time. You know, it gives you that in-depth perspective of what it's like to be in love and to go through the ups and downs, but it's laid out to you in such a gentle manner that it's not just so nerve wracking sometimes. There it is. It's cracking. Long story short, I flew back to LA, slept on Benny Cassette's couch. Um, he invited me to Westlake Studios and they had been working on the soundtrack for Queen and Slim for quite a while. Um, and I came in there and we were initially supposed to work on something else and we had a couple of friends inside and some writers and Benny put the record on and we just all put our heads together and the song just came about. It's such a beautiful song that came about in barely two hours. Like everything was okay. was written, recorded, and you know, and then we got the blessing of Tiana Major Nine, which just allows us to connect to our friends across the pond. Cause you know, we got we share the same stories, same similarities and stuff. So yeah, it's a beautiful song. Uh, to me, a legacy is something that you you pass on to, to others. A lot of times people refer to legacies as like, you know, I want to make sure my name is on a building or I want to make sure people remember me, you know, and it's kind of like self-centered. But to me, his legacy is something that you give others. It may be inspiration. It may be, you know what I'm saying, uh, an example of how you're supposed to live your life. Or it may be, you know, just I don't want to say things, but it may just be things that you can pass on to other generations, your children. It could be land, it could be wealth, it could be values. I think that's what a legacy is, something that you give on to people who are coming after you. I want my legacy to be one of truth, uh, self-expression, um, acceptance of others and of yourself, and uh, positivity. I want my legacy to be my music, my words, my feeling, my expression. I also want my legacy to be my future children as well, because I know they're gonna be they're gonna they're gonna be amazing. <laughs> my favorite movie soundtrack is Superfly. Uh, Curtis Mayfield is one of the biggest inspirations musically, stylistically in so many ways so many people have sampled a sample curtis mayfield and it's just so that superfly soundtrack is just a, a beautiful way i don't know how he just put that story into those into those songs like that he kind of just it's the movie is in the soundtrack and i think that's what makes a great soundtrack where you can listen to the, to the soundtrack and see the movie i have a few favorite movie soundtracks i really love the dream girl soundtrack the annie soundtrack the Wiz and also the new Lion King soundtrack is hard. I want people to take away from Queen and Slim to live your life in its truth. That's what I want people to take away from Queen and Slim, to be as truthful to yourself as you can and as truthful to others, you know, no matter 
what obstacles are in your path and no matter who around you um, is directing you in certain ways. Be, be true to yourself and be true to your life. I want people to be inspired by the journey of love from the song. That's what I want people to be inspired by because I mean, you know, sometimes you do collide with the people you love, whether it's, you know, friends, brothers, sisters, lovers, and you know, that that coming together offers you an opportunity to learn from yourself and learn from others and go forward. If I was Queen of Slim in that moment, I'd have done the same thing. I mean, I feel like uh, protection and self-preservation is of the utmost importance. That, that, that comes number one. You have to protect yourself and protect the people you love from, from any type of harm. And I think that is, you know, important for human beings and especially for us as a people. In that moment, if I was queen or slim, I would have ran. I'm not going to lie, I would have ran. I'm ride or die through thick and thin. You know what I'm saying? We're going to get it in. We're going to get it out. I'm going to make sure you good. I'm going to make sure I'm good. And that's what it is. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. From the Collides music video. You already know. Thank Tiana so Major much. 9. Mm -hmm. Earth Gang. Yes. Yeah. 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 It's Olu. lit. It's we lit. out here. It's lit. Queen is slim. Right. Go get that. Go, get Go that. see that. Go see that. Sneak in there. You know what I'm talking about?